told you a story, won't you? Right, folks, yeah, lesson. here we go now. Good morning, everybody. We're here at, uh, we're just coming to Medvin, as we speak right now. Medvin, now, Medvin um, is a famous place for a woman called um, Helen Gloag, who was the, who turned, in, turned into the Empress of Morocco um, in the 1600s. She, she went through uh, to Morocco and ended up marrying one of the sultans there. And um, because she had this mane of orange hair and high cheekbones and green eyes, um, and the Sultan was so taken by her. Now, there's still relatives of Helen Globe still exist today. Stagecoach in, lady. In, and well, Globe. We don't think it's her though, but um, so we're looking for people with orange hair, green eyes, and if possible, high cheekbones in Medford. So the streets are actually empty today though. <laughs> there's not a soul about, nobody to be seen. So. Anyway. Where's the farm with the bridge? Where's I that? think it's, it's down the way. Oh. I'm not actually sure. I need to look through my book and um, and find out. But uh, yeah, this guy's been emailing me, so thank you. I can't remember your name now, mate. Um, Joe. Was it Joe something? And Because uh, there's nobody on the streets at all. I know. Look at it. It's deserted. In 1603, the Battle of... 1306. 1306. The Battle of... The Moss Side. Just go knock on somebody's door and ask the judge. Excuse me. Are you, are you Mrs. Blow? There's Do nobody. You? I've not seen one person. It's crazy, man. Yeah, it's still early, it's Sunday. Almost half past ten on a Sunday. This Most be people like, should be out by now, yes. Just getting up ten, I think. No, no, there's some breads open. Oh, the shop. Oh, oh Sour Joe's, that's a new shop. Let's go and have a look. Yeah, I need to go and get some bread on the way home, maybe. I'm shot on the way home. Oh, probably. yeah, probably, yeah. Mm. Should have got in there right, 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 right bro. Should have stopped. Can I go back? Um, yeah, I'm not going to go back. Right, yeah, we're going to go back to the bread shop. Oh, there's a chain there, bro. Be careful, there's chains there. Because yeah, bro's determined to find find somebody <laughs> who with orange hair, right? Here's Sally Joe. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Right, folks, we have arrived here at St. Philan's. As you know, it's one of my favorite places here uh, at Locker and Head. Now, we're going to head up that way and along. Where are we going, Mum? I think what we'll have to do is go up behind the hotel and you're actually uh -huh. got to climb up and that's what us in the old building. Right. There. Okay then, no problem. That's what we shall do. Yeah, Mum knows the way. Let's do it. Screen walk and goat's path. Oh, Crikey, what's this? Hello? Oh, Crikey, hi. Okay. Right, we're going to go down the line. Now, this is the old railway line that we're on. Now, this is one that used to run from uh, Locker and Head all the way past St. Fillings, way down to Comrie. This is the main uh, steam line right here. And you can still see some of the remains off the uh, the, uh, the viaducts and the tunnels and the bridges and all sorts of stuff. It's still along here, man. No, hang on, they're having a whinge about something. Hang on, what's going on? to one here then lift latch then push gate right folks can you spot the uh the small bench i guess yeah. <laughs> 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 
mini park bench, everybody. Yes, there's there's a big one. There's a train down there, I think, is it? Right, here's one of the Beatles. The Beatles stayed here, folks. There you go, the Beatles. There it is. Bad. You're disappointing. So here's the Beatles one here, folks. The Beatles were here. Right, folks, we've come further up to the uh, the Clacken Hotel. We just past that now, at the top of Loch Ern Head, where Bro Bro said he's he thinks it's a walk up into the. Uh, well, we don't know. We're just gonna see what we can find. Trail. There we go. All right, we're done. Awesome colour starting to come through, folks. Find a place here, folks. Look. panicking because he thinks his walk that he's uh, got everybody hiking along is going to turn into a disaster but it's the fastest I've ever seen bro move there he goes around the corner he's, he's gone oh he's appeared again folks he has appeared oh, he doesn't look very happy though oh dear the rain's coming on though isn't it oh no disaster is it well See, coming in behind me there, folks. See on the hills there. That's the rain coming in. Bro, <laughs> sorry, sorry, everybody, sorry. All right, bro, what have you got to say for yourself? Nothing, I'm ashamed. No, oh, dear, oh, dear. My phone's all steamed up. I can't even see anything. I don't know what's going on with my phone here. Hang on. Right, folks, we have been uh, sent up this way by uh, some of the locals. Let's see what goes on up here then. Yeah, right, folks. Uh, a couple of locals just waved to us there and said, Are you lost? And uh, so we said, Oh, yes, we are. So they sent us up this way and said that there's a nice walk up into St. Philan's this way. So we'll walk up just up around the corner just a little bit because uh, Mum and Rosie are a bit. A bit, uh, well, as you can see by the way they walk it. Come all the way to the turn head for cycles, and then they've got a choice of going from up or down to. Oh, that's the castle on the other side. That's the lone paddle border. Is that what it's called? The castle on the other side? The young couple bought it and renovated it all. I don't know if they've got it now. Well, so at the end of the day, darling boy recovers and he's <laughs> he's back on form again. Well done, darling it's been boy. A short walk. Yes, he was all worried about everybody was shouting. Oh, oh no, I didn't like it. It's just rain and oh, I should keep my mouth shut. <laughs> but he's pulled through. Well done, bro. Well done, mate. <laughs> Always just turn right when you see a wee. Yes, ab road. absolutely. That's it. <laughs> 